having 17 children to feed and care for them in a homestead. Well, this is a daily challenge Mzee Omar Mohammed has to face to feed 17 children, some of whom are handicapped in Galile village at Tana River County. Tobas Chenji visited the family and tells us these challenges. This is a section of Tana River, Kenya's largest river, that has dried up and changed its course. A few kilometers from here, we head to Mzee Omar Mohammed's homestead, where everything describes the living condition of this family consisting of 17 children. Out of the 17 children, four were born with disabilities. Two are deaf, one was partially blind a few years ago, and the other one is using wheelchair as he cannot move. <laughs> Lakini hajiwezi, hayoni, akasumbua saa yote, akalia, manake hayoni, wakati menzake imekimbia, ye hawezi kukimbia. One of the boys, Abdul Nasir Muhammad, who was blind, benefited from a medical camp organized by the Kenya Post Authority and can now see. The rest of the siblings will, however, continue relying on their parents. He was treated by an ophthalmologist, Stanley Kipkemboi. Lakini saa hii. On examination, I found him to be having a congenital cataract. Uh, congenital cataract, which is a, it is, it is a condition that the crystalline lens is opaque. The nearest hospital is over 12 kilometers, and moving there is a challenge. Uh, Many families face these challenges of caring for persons with disabilities owing to delayed 